Hey, good morning, you guys. It is time for your health check. And uh, this is pretty exciting news. There is a new FDA-backed uh, treatment option when it comes to patients with COVID-19. Let me tell you about it. The FDA granted Eli Lilly emergency use authorization for its antibody treatment, which is a combination of two drugs, actually. It's taken through one intravenous infusion that lasts from 16 to 21 minutes, and it's authorized to treat mild to moderate COVID-19 in patients 12 and up who are at high risk for progressing to severe COVID or hospitalization. Now, according to studies, phase three data shows this treatment reduced the risk of hospitalization and death by 70%. The company says the therapy should be given as soon as possible after a positive COVID test and within 10 days of feeling symptoms. That's because during this time, that's when your viral load is really high, meaning you have a lot of virus inside of the body. And these COVID-19 therapeutics known as neutralizing antibodies essentially neutralize the virus and allow your body to quickly uh, kind of get rid of it and then allow your natural immune system to fight it. The drug maker plans to manufacture up to 1 million doses by the middle of this year. This, by the way, does not replace vaccines. Now, when it does come to vaccines, we are blessed, privileged, all of it. Listen to this. Of the 128 million vaccine doses administered so far, more than 75 percent are in just 10 countries. In a joint statement, the directors of the World Health Organization and UNICEF say there are 130 countries with 2.5 billion people who have yet to administer a single dose. They're calling for world leaders to look beyond their borders and share vaccines with frontline healthcare workers around the world first. They also ask vaccine manufacturers to share technology so other companies can help to speed up global production. And finally, a new study out of Texas A&M finds some energy drinks have damaging effects on the muscle cells of your heart. This research is published in Food and Chemical Toxicology, scientists evaluated 17 brands of energy drinks, and they link consumption of those to increased blood pressure, improper beating of the heart, and cardiomyopathy, which makes it hard for the heart to pump blood. Pro tip, choose water instead.